Hey there, how's it going? So there are five critical skills that you need to be able to succeed with your own product side hustle, selling some kind of product. Now, uh, most people are not much good at especially all these skills. And that's why when they go out there to try and launch a side hustle, a lot of the time yeah, it fails and they struggle. So you need all five skills and the better you can get at these five skills, the better your side hustle is going to go. Now, uh, the, the type of side hustle that I recommend is what I call a product-based side hustle. That means you're selling either an e-commerce product, an info product, or a software as a service product so that you're not doing manual service type work, which sucks up a lot of time and means that you might not have enough time to actually get the business off the ground if you're working a full-time job. So you want to uh, follow this product-based side hustle model. Now, you do need five critical skills. So let's see what they are. The very first skill that you need is you're going to need to be able to build a personal brand. Nowadays, a lot of business promotion is done via personal brand. This is why you see people like Mr. Beast be able to build up his brand like a Fistables. Uh, a product company based off of Mr. Beast's own personal brand as a YouTuber. So personal brand is critically important. In decades past, maybe you could get away with uh, some other types of promotion. But the reality is that uh, nowadays, if you don't get good at personal brand, you're really going to struggle to compete with uh, the competition. So you need to get good at building a personal brand. Now, skill number two that you're gonna need is you're gonna need to get really good at marketing. Personal brand and marketing are related, but marketing just means you need to get good at traditional kinds of marketing as well, uh, including things like email marketing, including things like um, running some advertising you need to have uh, an idea of how to run paid advertising uh, so that you're not clueless now like i said a lot of marketing nowadays is actually personal brand uh, but the traditional kinds of marketing are still very relevant especially when you're scaling uh, your, your side hustle into a much bigger business so if you don't know those skills you're gonna run into problems uh, so you do need to actually study the, the broader discipline of marketing uh, in its entirety as well. Now, that's not to say necessarily you need to go and get an MBA, even though I, you know, I think that an MBA is a good thing. I recently did a video where I actually reviewed <laughs> whether as a side hustler, you should uh, do an MBA or not. So you can check out that video for more details on that. Now let's move on to the third skill. The third skill that you need is you need to get good at sales. Sales, uh, some people say sales is the lifeblood of a business, but if you get the personal brand right and you get the marketing right, you don't have to be the best sales pers uh, salesperson on earth, all right? You can grow your side hustle without being the best at sales. But you still need to learn the basics, the fundamentals. So I suggest you actually look up like an online course on sales. Personally, I learned sales from people like Jordan Belfort, and I also picked up, uh, you know, some trainings from people like um, Sabris Ubi, who has got a great uh, sales uh, series on YouTube. Uh, Brian Tracy, Jim Rohn have a lot, have put out a lot of pieces over the years on mindset for sales and things like that. And I've also benefited from classic books like How I Transformed Myself from failure to success in sales by uh, Frank Becher, a guy named Frank Becher, who, whose book has actually helped a lot of people. So I, I recommend resources like that to turn yourself into a good salesperson. You need to get very comfortable selling your product because you're gonna be selling, uh, if you're selling a, a high end, especially a high ticket software as a service or high ticket course, uh, then, uh, or even a high ticket product, 
uh, in your e-commerce store, but you know something that's uh, you know maybe super high ticket, specialized, then you might be getting on the phone with people, and you need to be able to actually uh, guide them through the sale, and you need to be able to you need to study sales to get good enough to be able to do that. So that's uh, uh, skill set number three. And skill set number four is uh, product. You need to know as much as possible about your product. If you're a side hustler and you want to uh, build, uh, just a random example, let's say you want to build the next electric car. If you know zero about the product, about electric cars, then uh, you can imagine how good your product is gonna be. It's not gonna be much good. Like look at Elon Musk. He's a total product expert. That's how you wanna be where, where it comes to your product. You wanna be the guy or girl that's super knowledgeable about that particular type of product so that you can craft a really good product. Now, as I have mentioned elsewhere, you don't need the best product in the world, just like you don't need to be the best salesman in the world. Uh, so this, it's kind of like a combination thing where it's not one particular thing that's going to kill you, but you need, uh, you need a good combination, you know, where everything is at least good enough. And then, you know, you can succeed with your side hustle. Uh, finally, the fifth and final skill that you need is you need management skills. Now management in the beginning, as a solopreneur, there'll be no employees, it'll be just you. So what you need there is you need what's called self-management. This is creating a schedule for yourself and saying, on this day, I'm going to work on these items for my side hustle. On the next day, I'm going to work on these other items and making sure when you're in that time, that's what you're doing. TikTok is off. You know, and you're actually just focused on what you're doing. You're not watching TV. You're not out uh, playing in the backyard. <laughs> you know, you're actually uh, working on what you say that uh, needs to be done. So that's how you manage yourself. This is very fundamental. As a solopreneur, this should come naturally to you. Uh, and you should uh, be working on improving that skill because it makes you move faster. Now, as you grow your business and it begins to scale, you're going to have a team. And now management transitions from self-management to managing a small team. And you need to learn how to do that, how to be an effective leader, how to motivate people, uh, how to give people feedback, how to hire the uh, best people in the first place. So management becomes important, um, starting with self-management and then becoming team management as you grow your side hustle. And you can grab some of my free resources to help you with building your own product-based side hustle. The links will be in the description.